Hello everyone, these are the stories for today. Let's begin with First news, world's oceans hit breaks record in 2021. According to the latest annual globe climate report by the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, NOAA, a US scientific and regulatory agency. The annual global ocean heat content for 2021 for the upper 2000 meters was record high in 2021, exceeding the previous record set in 2020. This new record was set despite the cooling effects of the two La Nina events from last year. The oceans with high heat record were the North Atlantic Ocean, the North Pacific Ocean, and the Mediterranean Sea. Since 1955, more than 90% of the excess heat produced by global warming has been absorbed by the oceans. The heat content is a better indicator of global warming than atmospheric temperature. Warmer oceans are helping supercharged storms, hurricanes, and severe rainfalls in some parts of the world. Urgent actions need to be taken to mitigate global warming. Next, veggie diet in the wild in farmers could help reduce carbon dioxide from the air. Well, this is very relevant in connection to the previous news. Perhaps each of us can take actions and do our part to help reduce carbon emissions. A quarter of global greenhouse gas emissions come from food and agriculture, with livestock accounting for the bulk in rich nations. Raising and growing livestock for meat needs huge amounts of land, which if reduced can help in the reforestation of that land with wild plants and trees drawing down carbon from the atmosphere. According to estimations, 100 billion tons of carbon dioxide could be removed from the air by the end of this century through vegetarians and rewilding farmlands. The researchers estimated the effect of a shift to a diet, with a bit of meat but a lot of vegetables by more than 50 high-income nations. Time to think on how we can help in reducing global warming. Last news for today, Roma trading town and an exquisite wooden figure and earth in the UK. Undergoing diggings to lay down the foundations for Britain's new high-speed train, the HS2 rail link that will connect London with the north part of the country is unearthing details about ancient Roman life in the area. Recently, the team working on the project unearthed a vast Roman trading settlement with historical treasures dating back to as far as 43 to 70 AD. The findings include a large Roman road, coins, jewelry, glass vessels, high decorative pottery, some evidence of ancient makeup, and an exquisite carved wooden figure, incredibly preserved. It is almost intact and well defined with only the feet and arms below the elbow a bit degraded, considering the fact that organic objects do not survive much in, in such underground conditions. These findings are undergoing examinations and conservation processes before they can be displayed to the public. For sure, these discoveries will provide valuable information about Britain's past history. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. This is Michael Brand of Newscast. Subscribe to my channel for the latest news and updates every week.